بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته شابتر 3 job attitude and the satisfaction job attitude and the satisfaction what's attitude attitude it's evaluative statement either favorable or unfavorable concerning objects people or events reflect how one feels about something attitude what's attitude it's our judgment it's our evaluative statements toward everything we have attitude toward food toward the place toward song toward songer toward the perfume whatever we evaluate everything surrounded us there are three main components of attitudes a cognitive component i mean evaluation affective component i mean feelings and behavior component i mean action uh, let's take example a cognitive component evaluation my supervisor gave a promotion to my to a co-worker who deserved is it less than me my supervisor is unfair she evaluate her supervisor that he is unfair he she know him and evaluate him i dislike my supervisor it's second component effective feelings and third behavior i'm looking for another work it's action she will take action <laughs> attitudes follow behaviors or behavior follow attitudes normally behavior follow attitudes but sometimes attitudes follow behavior when we start attitude first when we start behavior first and then uh, attitude become uh, 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 um, compatible or incompatible with uh, with a behavior this is a psychological problem cognitive dissonance what's cognitive dissonance cognitive dissonance it's any inconsistency between two or more attitudes or between behavior and attitudes and people individuals seek to minimize dissonance dissonance yes desire to reduce dissonance is determined by the importance of elements, the degree of influence, the rewards. And sometimes we using a moderated variables to reduce the dissonance between attitude and behavior. What is the major job attitude? There are six major job attitude. One job satisfaction, two job involvement, three psychological empowerment, four organizational commitment, five perceived organizational support, and finally MBE engagement. What is the major job attitude? Six job major job attitude. One job satisfaction. What job satisfaction? It's a positive feeling about the job resulting from an evaluation of its characteristics it's overall evaluation yes what's job involvement job involvement is a degree of psychological identification with the job where perceived performance is important to self worth what psychological empowerment Believe in the degree of influence over the job, competence, job, meaning, meaning is, meaningfulness, and autonomy. Organizational commitment, 
it measure how much a, com a, a, a company committed to uh, to its uh, MBUEs. Whatever this type of commitment, it's economic commitment or emotional commitment. Five, perceived organizational support or BRS, degree or to which MBE believes that uh, the company values their uh, co uh, contribution and the curves about their well being. And high BOS, high B perceived organization support is related to higher OCBs and performance. And finally, MBE engagement. And finally, MBE engagement, it's, it describes the psychological relationship between MBE and their company. How to measure job satisfaction. What causes job satisfaction? What is causes job satisfaction? Three element or three factor causes job satisfaction. One, the work itself. The strongest correlation with overall satisfaction. The work itself. Second, social component, community in the work, there is a strong correlation with how people view the social context of their work. And finally, pay, pay, I mean payment, I mean salary and other benefits, uh, which uh, it's not created after individual reach a, a level of comfortable living. What is the consequences of job dissatisfaction? What is the reaction? What is the MBOE reactions of job dissatisfaction? One, exit. Active, distractive action. Voice. Active, constructive action. Loyalty. Passive constructive action, neglect, passive, distractive action. This is the reactions of job dissatisfaction. Exit. What's exit? It's behavior directed toward leaving the organization. And what's voice? It's active and constructive attempts to improve conditions. And what's UAT? It's passively waiting for condition to improve. And what's neglect? Allowing condition to be worse. This is the reactions of job dissatisfaction. What is the benefit of job satisfaction? The benefits of job satisfaction it's uh, higher performance, higher OCBs, higher uh, perception, uh, fairness perception, customer satisfaction, your absenteeism and your turnover, and your work based diverse. What is the benefit of job satisfaction? The benefits of job satisfaction can we, we can summarize into higher performance. If you are satisfied, you will perform, perform better. High job satisfaction means higher performance, and high job satisfaction means higher organization and citizenship behaviors, I mean OCBs. Higher job satisfaction means higher firmness perception. Higher job satisfaction means a higher customer satisfaction. Yes, satisfied MBE, increased customer retention and loyalty. 
because satisfied MBE will provide the customer a high quality service. High of job satisfaction means a low absentees. And also, high job satisfaction means a low turnover. And finally, higher job satisfaction means you work place divert. Manager should ask should ask the MBE service are you satisfied? Yes or no? And you are not if you are not satisfied, I mean if you are dissatisfied, a manager should attack the source of the problem, dissatisfaction. Rather than trying to control the different responses to that dissatisfaction. Satisfied MBE will perform better, better OCBs, increase customer satisfaction, decrease absentees and turnover and decrease work based diverts. And dissatisfied lower productivity, lower OCBs, decrease customer satisfaction, increase absentees, increase turnover, increase work base divert. Thank you, my student, and see you next lecture and next chapter, inshallah.